Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, The IIT Encoder. We have already been done with the first two questions of Division 2. So let us move on to the first question of Division 1. It is even P sum or even pair sum. So we will be looking at how do we approach this question and it has a very easy approach and it is a very question, very easy question because this is the first question of Division 1. But from here, the things will start becoming a little tough. So let's look at the question and understand it first. So this is the question even pair sum. What is this question? In this question, you are given two pairs of integers, basically two integers, two positive integers a and b. And you need to find the number of pairs of positive integers x comma y such that x belongs to close bracket a close bracket a and y belongs to close bracket 1, close bracket b and x plus y is even. So this is basically a very easy straightforward question on parity and you are given t number of test cases and a, b. So as a and b are of the order of 10 raised to 9, it's very clear that the solution should have log n or o constant time complexity. That's for sure. And t is also 1000. Now you just need to take, see it's a parity question so it's very easy. Just take the number of cases in which x plus y is even, x comes from a and y comes from b. So your hint is check the parities when x plus y is even, select those parities, make cases and then find the total number of cases which are valid. Now let's take a look at the test cases. This is 4, 1, 1. So basically we have only one number in each and 1 plus 1 is even. So the answer is 1, 2, 3. Similarly you can do for all just brute force and check if these test cases are correct and then make an approach on how to find all the cases when x plus y is even and for a comma b less than equal to n you can even brute force and you will get the answer so that's all for this question i guess i have explained enough so let's move on to the next question in the next video and hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for more such solutions if you have any doubts leave it in the comment section